This video is dedicated to my buddy Poison Chowder, also known as Casey. He is freaking immaculate friend, been one for over four years now, and he is a Wraith player. He is an esports player for his college, um, and he does a lot of DVD. I met him through Twitch a long time ago, so he does stream from time to time. It's not frequent, but from time to time. His Twitch will be linked down below, first one in the description, so give him a follow and turn on notifications if you don't mind to, and show him some love sometime for me. Let him know that we said Joe, okay? But yeah. If you're new here, I ask you to give this video a try, and if you like it, awesome. Give it a subscribe. If you don't like it, that's okay. At least you gave it a shot, and genuinely thank you. That's all I could ever ask. So, on to the video. So, for the build breakdown, this was kind of abnormal compared to what we do. We have Distressing, Bad Grit, Agitation, Starstruck. I think you already know how this goes if you have almost any experience in DBD. But if you don't, Distressing makes your terror radius big. Um, agitation makes it bigger while you're carrying people, so double big. You now cover roughly about 56 meters to 60 meters of a map. You have Maggot, which allows you to swing multiple times while you're carrying someone, uh, with no cooldown. And if you hit someone, it pauses the timer for 4 seconds. And Starstruck makes people exposed while you're carrying them, and 30 seconds after you hook them. It has a cooldown of a minute, but that 30 seconds does apply while the minute's going. So you really only have a cooldown of 30 seconds. Super freaking cool. But yeah, figured this would be more of a fun one. Nothing you'll really see in an esports competition, but something you'll definitely like. So give it a shot if you ever want to have some fun. Take care. I'll see you soon. Okay, cool, cool, cool. I'm going to be annoyed by the sheer number of pallets, but because people are going to be super grouped up, I can really make this work. I think I saw one toolbox in unloading as well, so I may be lucky and blessed, and someone may have a saboteur build. So, so I'll make them rue the, rue the day that they were born. Let's see. Anyone up top? Because if I was spawning in this map, I'd spawn here. I was going to say bathroom, but you know what? Sure. You don't have a power off the bat, do you, kiddo? Not the one down here I spoke too soon, but we can fly. And we're pretty cool like that. He really came back to say, nah, I'm not done yet. <laughs> I respect it, Max. Let's see what else you got, kiddo. We're going to pretend we didn't see Fang here. And run this way. I say we get multiple um, injuries and pressure if we can. This seems slightly split right now. Nice try. Maybe I would have thought you were in the cage, an animal. Back in the zoo. But no, that doesn't quite work. Different century, different time period. Okay, cool. Easy kickins. And then we get this power whipped up. We go mid. That hook right there will do just fine. Assuming I can make it to it. Oh, there were survivors here. Hold up. I don't need to go all that far. Took you here. Definitely exposed a decent number of people up with that. Let's see. There was a trail here. Up top, I presume? I'm gonna kick this real quick. I think I hear Ada. Not for sure. One of those mannequins were moving. Hey, kid. You have good awareness. Okay. Let's break this. Be right back, kiddo. Just relax for me, okay? Alright, we're gonna kick. Pressure. I'm not seeing Lori. I know that Lori and Claudette, one of the two, at some point, was in mid. I'm not sure what happened past that. Well, there's Claudette. We can keep the general regressing, which is good. Have to get a solid thing hit here. And Starstruck's almost refreshed, which is really nice if we can get it that way. Did you run back up? Yes, you did. Honestly, kind of expected that, which is great for us. She may have balance. I don't think so. I'll see if I can hit her through the pallet, because at the time, survivors will get pulled in the middle when they go and do a pallet, and they get hit when they otherwise would. Like, maybe? Yeah, she got plenty to play with. So here's the deal right now. We have to be pallet eating simulator. And break what we can and hit who we can and why we can. I ideally need people nearby. Am I likely to get people nearby? Mm -mm. Is someone above me? Yes. Maybe they're right there. No, we got one here. That thing will do just fine. And here's Johnny. Oh, I got Ada here? How did I just switch characters? Change signs. I have a good 20 seconds to make this work. Okay, cool. She got cut off. I don't think she makes this to the pallet again. Nah, not really. Very confident of her to not do that the first time. Now, I think she would have got punished either way. Ooh. And way down we go. 
There's no way I was risking that, man. Okay, cool. Eight is hooked. Let's check on our assets. And by assets, I mean gin. So by gin, I mean generator. Because those are important, apparently. Hey, Fang. Welcome back. Good to see ya. If you keep coming to the same place, I'm gonna keep coming back, too. Like, I got your number, girl. But like, we'll see. I don't know if any of you guys have balance. There was a game offering brought to this, which is fine. You know, map offers are part of the game. I may be annoyed by them sometimes, by the 15 million pounds, but like, you know. Okay, kidding. We're done breaking. Oh, I wasted my time, hers, and everyone else is here, so I apologize for that by hitting the bell, but that's okay. Let's see. I think we can cut her off here. It's almost on this side. see I think I can get this so I want to stop them if I can Laura and Lori not Laura Laura and I said again freaking those two are together I caught it now what ideally we play around with this palette and use it okay cool swinging like baseballer that's fun uh let's kick this gem two people are two people healthy and a clotted at my disposal I'm gonna break this I don't want to deal with people using that to their advantage later. I got two gins that are mainly being targeted. Neither is too heavily focused. So there's nothing I have to be like, oh god about. But like at the same time, we're chilling, so. I feel like they're looping around this way. I hear one. There. If we can use these... That's a bummer. If we can use these now, palette-wise, I'm actually chill with it. Because honestly, late game having to deal with like, oh, let's just say the doors are already. Oh god, I gotta go through this last pallet. It's awful. So if she throws an L, like it's not gonna hurt anything for me. She's definitely gonna throw it here in just a second, I feel. Try and cut me off. If she doesn't, she dies, so. I mean, she could do both. That would work. Happy, happy fun time. Let me put it that way. Alright, let's take her away. So we're gonna try to head to the middle of the map once again to emphasize part of the build to be safe about this. Um, is that we have agitation, bigger terror radius, distressing bigger terror radius, and then star shot, exposure and terror radius. Middle map covers almost the entire map. A map like the game is a beautiful one to take me to. Okay, cool. We're gonna put the fear of God into them. I swing a lot early these days, a lot more than I ever once did, to try and make people think I'm gonna whiff more often than I'm not. I know it may sound really counterproductive because I am whipping by doing this, but it's all part of my master plan, therefore it's okay. It's what is not part of your master plan that's cringe. Oh, huh, they chose to die. Honestly, valid choice. Okay, three survivors left, four generators. And then we're pissed off Scott and a Wraith that has a big old glove. I say we're in good shape. Let's see what's nearby. One thing here. Nothing there. Anyone above? The two gins I was worried about prior regressing, so that's good. Hi, Lori. Also known as Laura on accident. You see, here's the deal, right? If you body block me, you are actively asking, please hit me in borrowed time. Please hit me whatever I've finished using borrowed or anything like that. Like, you're actively saying tunnel me. And it's like, brother, if I, if I wait 10 seconds and I choose to tunnel you, and in the aftergame you're like, Oh my god, you tunnel me, how could you? It's like, you, you are body blocking me to try and save a friend. Like, what do you mean? Ooh, I had to try. I just hold myself. I just was part of their Twitch montage. I don't want to talk about it. Get away. I'm going to directly back up for this. Oh, you fool. You thought you were safe? I guarantee this power has not been used. There we go. Look up. Ooh. Nice blind, man. I mean, flashlights can't be blinding, yeah, but I don't feel like my cataracts get that covered by it, truth be told. I just get to see, like, the sun for a second longer than I normally would. Hey, boys. What's cooking? Where is anyone? There we go. Okay, cool, cool, cool. I'm looping myself, but it's fun. Hey, Lord. I want to hook on you really badly right now. You have Calm Spirit. Anytime they don't scream when you hit them, Calm Spirit. Or they're really, really freaking strong. 
guess which one my penny is. Oh, first, you walked over here. You walked to this corner. You got bite the bullet and self care. Those are your first, or are you just using a med kit? Honestly, can't tell. I like that she took a second to consider her actions and continue to heal regardless of the situation. Hey, Fang. I'm going for glory. Come on. I couldn't make it. That's a shame. I wanted it. It was so close. Why not? But just, but just why? You're a smart one. Most people would have bolted there. You chose not to. Over the side you go. Let's try this mad grip again. Unless Fang blinds me with the flashlight, in which case my cataracts will kick in. Honestly, I thought you couldn't blind early so anymore. I thought it just counted. Interesting. Going for glory, take two. Okay, it's not going to work at all. We're going this way. Walking slightly away. Okay, now this is just me. I hear you though, little one. Nice. No blind this time? Are we out of juice? Have some more juice for me? Let's see how it is. Let's go put the living fuel in God and Ada. Because Lori will be fine. They're going to finish that gin. They could have that gin. I don't really care about that gin. Hello? Fine by me. We come out. She looks like, oh, I just made a cool play. Yeah, I'm gonna watch you. It's like, ultimately, it's like, okay. Your friend also just body blocked your flashlight, brother. I would yell them in the in-game chat after this. Because that may have just cost you your life. Either that or your hubris. One of the two. Guys, it's cool to have a big vocabulary. Just saying. People are like, oh my god, you use such big words. means that you have a brain cell that isn't just run purely on TikTok. Speaking of which, go follow my TikTok. I'm kidding. I really don't do anything over there. Again. Alright, alright. She got her priorities straight. And now we're just down to Ada. Hook you here real quick. She's already injured and Starship's already struck, so... We got 100 down real quick. Looking for any trail of blood. She's not going to be far. Not horribly far. I should went for the save. Good friend. Good friend. I think they come out this way. Hey, do. She's running back like, please, please, please. She ain't going to make it, though. I missed. She dead-hearted, though. Actually, that makes me feel slightly better. Okay, she's done. Oh, we're done to Lori. He's going to be healing. I guarantee it. We could take her to the basement. I don't think Lori likely went that way. So I, I know she came towards this way. Let's look her here and be patient and wait. Um, honestly, this door's open. I'm just gonna break this door as well. I have time. So I was like, okay. Lori, in my opinion, definitely heals. As to what she does past that is unbeknownst to me. We'll see. Wait, did I just... No. Yeah, she just healed up. Nothing in the oddly weird room. Red. She was this way. Alright, Lori, let's do it. Most pals have been used already at this point, which is lovely and convenient. If we did manage to get to two gems, I don't think Lori's going to be able to run for the next 180 seconds. Assuming that our Ada can literally teleport to gems. Which is unlikely. So we should be completely secure gen wise, which is awesome. I also considering the fact that you really don't have gen defense, you'll notice the first two gens we just kicked. We just purely kicked. By kicking those gens, we saved them for a long time. One we did end up losing, right? One was gone. That's okay. The other, actually still going. So it's like, having those two, I'm like, yeah, that's good stuff. I swear I heard her for a second. It's fine. Because one way or another, we'll find her. Try and find Hatch if we can. Hatch is always 50-50. A lot of the time. Unless there's an offering. If they get it before you, don't feel bad. It's just the way life goes. So don't be like, oh god, I'm, I'm awful. I just lost the biggest, like, streak of my life. It's like, it's okay, man. Sometimes you can't help. It'll just spawn on them. Sometimes it spawns on you. It's that RNG. 
That's just the way it is. Right, we're gonna try and track down Max the Ada. We're gonna do it where it started and finish it there. All right, no lights over there. It's kind of convenient that I can see the lights from a decent distance. I feel like I'll know if she gets on this one. I'm double checking this way. You will see that one from such a distance to such an advantage to actually goes hard. All right. There may be a large track of blood this way. Up the stairs we go. She doesn't have too many options here. She can go back downstairs and solve her time. I mean, no matter what, she's ultimately dead here. So she's got to keep pushing as far as she can, which is great. I mean, that's what you're meant to be doing. Is she went for bathroom hole? No, she's not. That's good. So she had two pallets to play off of here. And we can force her either back to that pallet or just kill her here. Down the stairs we go. And three, one. Dead hard. Okay, nice. I think everything about that was physically wrong that could have been, but that's okay. Is that door open? Oh, you ran this way, girl. Okay. I was like, wait a second. I think we confused each other mainly because I made the wrong move first. Okay, because I need to catch her quickly. And I don't have time to be like, oh, let me just like dawdle about. I'm gonna get up directly on her real quick and see if that's enough. So we just need to stop the timer. I think I know exactly. She saw the pallet here. Right? So she's like, oh, I'm gonna go around and throw the pallet down so he can't get the hook. We're gonna pick her up. Agitation should be enough to get us to that hook in time. So we can get our extra late game hook points. Huge. Good game. And it's right on time. So, I hope you enjoyed that. Like I said, this video is in dedication to my friend Casey, who is a Wraith main. Hopefully, you enjoy this. So, if you're new here, please subscribe if you liked it. If not, that's okay. You'll probably end up like eight up. So, that's what happens people don't subscribe. Hope you have a lovely day, and take care of yourself. Cheers, mate.